Ryan Neal Tendoskit born June 30, 1980, is a Dutch South African cricketer who has represented the Netherlands at both One Day International and 2020 International level. He has been named ICC Associate Player of the Year on a record three occasions, in 2008, 2010, and 2011. Born and raised in South Africa, Tendoskit signed with Essex CCC for the 2003 English season, qualifying under the Kolpak ruling through his Dutch, and hence European Union, citizenship. A right-handed all-rounder, he first represented the Dutch national team at the 2005 ICC Trophy, and has since played a number of other tournaments for the side, including the 2009 World 2020 and the 2011 World Cup. At the latter tournament, Tendoskit scored 119 runs against England, the first ODI century by a Dutch player against a full member of the ICC. At domestic level, Tendoskid first established himself as a regular for Essex during the 2006 season, and was named the team's limited overs captain for the 2014 season. He has also represented a number of professional 2020 sides in other countries, including franchises in Australia's KFC 2020 Big Bash, the Bangladesh Premier League, the Indian Premier League, New Zealand's HRV 2020, South Africa's Miwe T20 Challenge, and Zimbabwe's Stamak Bank 20 Series. He matriculated at Fairbairn College in Goodwood, near Cape Town in 1998. While at school, he excelled at both rugby and cricket. In 2003, Graham Booch was on tour with Essex in South Africa and saw Tendoskit's talent for the first time in a match against a Western Province second 11. Against Essex, he first excelled with the ball in a four day game. He then did well with the bat in a one dayer. It did not take long for Gooch to talk to old friend Peter Kirsten one of the Western Province coaches who mentioned Tendoskit's EU citizenship passport that would make him eligible to play in England. In 2008, Tendoskit became one of the cornerstones of a strong Essex team and enjoyed success with them by winning the Friends Provident Trophy and Pro 40 Division 2. During a Clydesdale Bank 40 match against the Derbyshire Falcons, Tendoskit managed 109 not out as the Essex Eagles won on the Duckworth-Lewis method. In 2010, Tendoskit led the batting averages for Essex in England's Friends Provident T20, making 296 runs in six matches at an average of 59.20. He also had best economy rate for his side, conceding 6.81 runs and over, though he bowled only 11 overs. In 2010, he signed with Tasmania for the 2020 Big Bash in 2010-11. He was joined Pakistan fast bowler Rana Naved Ul Hassan as Tasmania's two international players the season. Tendoskit was declared the most valuable player the last time he played in the tournament for Canterbury in the 2010-11 season with 284 runs from nine games to be the second highest run getter in the league. He was also their joint fourth highest wicket taker with 12 wickets in 9 games at an average of 17.66 and played a key role in their wins over Wellington and Otago early in the competition. In January 2011, Tendoskit was picked by the Kolkata Knight Riders team in the IPL 2011 auction for $150,000. Tendoskit also was the first associate player to win an IPL contract. His selection made Tendoskit the second Dutch player after Dirk Nans to play in the Indian Premier League. In 2011, he smashed 121 not out off 58 balls to lead Mashonaland Eagles to the final of the Stamak Bank 20 series. Tendoskit's 100 helped Eagles beat Matabaliland Tuskers by 23 runs on the Duckworth Lewis method in the qualifying final and set up a clash with Mountaineers. He struck eight sixes and six fours in his innings and was unperturbed by wickets falling at the other end. In 2012, he signed Otago Volts in the HRV Cup, New Zealand's T20 League. 5. During the season 10 Doskit finished second on the run scorer list with 401 runs in 10 innings at an average of 50.12. In 2013, in the Bangladesh Premier League, the Kings needed one batsman to take charge, and after Brendan Taylor left that responsibility was taken by Tendoskit. Tendoskit finished as the second highest run scorer of the tournament. The form of Ravi Bapura had initially led to Tendoskit being benched, Tendoskit held firm, and in the crucial moments, 
His stylish shots came out readily when required. Even when wickets were falling at the other end, and he was struggling with his timing, Tendoskit had an answer case in point, the second semi-final against the Sillet Royals when he struck a vital 44 off 28 balls to steer the Kings home, and into the BPL final.